and I just see my little sister with her back on, face, her back to the staircase, and Johnny swings at her, and I don't even wait, don't even wait for any other, I don't hesitate, I don't wait, I just in my head instantly think of Kate Moss and the stairs, and I swung at him. And all of my relationship to date with Johnny. And that was how Amber Heard destroyed her very well-built evidence into an opportunity for Johnny to actually win the case. From just the reaction of Ben and the other Depp's attorney's reaction, we can see how gleaming they suddenly become while Amber is still trying to narrate her well-rehearsed story. A lot of people have been wondering why Johnny and his team was so elated from hearing Amber's testimony when she is at that time accusing Johnny for hurting her and her sister. I just remember this, this brief struggle we had before kind of break away Whitney, my sister, um, all of a sudden put herself in between Johnny and I. Uh, she just threw herself like in the line of fire or whatever. She just all of a sudden was there and was trying to get Johnny to stop. Um, her back was to the staircase and Johnny swings at her well, the reason is pretty simple. She mentioned Kate Moss. Kate Moss and Johnny used to date some time back before they broke up, but the two still remained friends. Now, she had been a part of Johnny's witness before the court denied her due to the fact that she was not pertaining or relevant to the issue at hand. In court, there's this rule where one side is not supposed to bring things up unless the other side brings it first. In Johnny's case, he wasn't supposed to talk about previous relationships unless Amber did first, so when Amber accidentally mentioned Kate Moss, she opened up a leeway for Johnny to be able to freely talk about his and Amber's exes. Now not only will that be possible, but there's also a possibility that Joni's attorneys will bring up Amber's domestic violence charge that she was charged with while still together with her ex-girlfriend. A female police officer had spotted Amber slapping her ex-girlfriend and had booked her for domestic violence, though the charges were dropped with a warning since the two women lived far from the court's proceedings. Who has spent 30 years in the spotlight, going from rising teenage star to supermodel superstardom in the blink of an eye. Can we talk about how you were discovered? I love this story. It was here in New York? Yeah, at JFK. What happened? My dad worked for Pan Am, and we were on our way back from a holiday, and at the time, we were traveling on standby. Years later, her ex-girlfriend tried defending her, saying Amber was such a kind soul who would never hurt her, and that the officer who arrested Amber was homophobic. It was later revealed that the officer was a lesbian activist. I don't feel like it's ever been reproduced. No, it was young love, it's a, and we were so innocent and young and so excited about the work, about everything, and everything was so new to us, like going to the Caribbean was like... Not only would there be women supporting Johnny, but a domestic violence charge on Amber's head will be fatal for her. So we got on the plane and my agent was on the plane, and she came up and said, oh, have you ever thought about modelling? And I was like, no. And then we went to see her in London, and they signed me up. It might also be possible for Vanessa Johnny's girlfriend, the mother of his two children, to be allowed as a witness in trial, and if this happens, then Amber is doomed. Not only does she support Johnny, but claims for all the years she's been with Johnny, he was a kind and supporting father, and also an excellent father to their kids. It's her own loss, though. It seems like she had forgotten that she can't mention Johnny's exes, or maybe her team had not briefed her on not mentioning that since it would affect her. That might be the case. Her team has been doing a poor job of explaining to Amber how things work in court, and she's super confused and doesn't know how to phrase that. Or maybe she was trying to counterclaim the fact that news was out about her hitting and mistreating her own sister. Did you get in a fight or something? Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Got into an altercation. Proof, say Johnny Depp's lawyers, that Amber Heard attacked her sister. I can't believe Amber beat your ass. And she wanted to prove that she came to her sister's rescue when Johnny the monster attacked her. Or maybe she thought by mentioning Kate, the courtroom would be convinced that she wasn't the only person who Johnny had abused. Well, that's all we can speculate about why she decided to mention Kate. The one thing we are sure about is the fact that she threw herself under the bus giving Depp an upper hand in the case. She also didn't seem to realize what she had done until after noticing how happy the other team looked. And I swung at him. And all of my relationship to date with Johnny, I hadn't landed a blow. Anyways, thanks for watching, and that's it for this video. More on the Johnny Depp and Amber Heard trial on our other videos.